Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn for the month of May. So this is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Here we go. What do we got for Capricorn? Keep in mind, this may or may not be for you. I can't read for every single person. What's to come? <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> a new beginning. I mean, this is a new beginning. With endings bring new beginnings. That's what this is. So you, this is major. One, one, one phase of your life, right? And that's basically what this is. You guys are about to step into a new life. This is a new life. Oh my God. Transitioning. You are transitioning into your full power. Stable, solid, secure. You're in your own element. You're grounded. Getting exactly what you deserve. This is give and take. With This is an equal opportunity where you, you know, you work with somebody where, you know, there's equal back and forth. It's not one-sided. Getting what you deserve. This is heading towards a more balanced partnership. Oh, the chariot reversed. There's been a delay in getting what you deserve because of an ending. This is a delay because of an ending. It has been a delay because you had to find your ability to, to pick yourself back up. I mean, that's what this is. Get back in your element to master your emotions. There's a lot of fear here. The chariot reversed is fear. You may be fearing this new beginning, fearing this new life. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Cancer. This is letting go of the past hurts. Letting go of that ending. Okay, this is letting go of the past hurts. It is. This is releasing the pain and healing and you're on the way to your recovery. And it's time to leave the past hurts behind. That's what it means. time for your new life you're gonna have to be courageous you're gonna have to find the courage and the confidence and the strength to go after what you are passionate about you need to take on these energies of confidence be confident this is a very, this is the the king this is the most passionate king so if you're the female you may you may have uh, opportunity with a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. If you're the female, and this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, by the way, so you could have an opportunity with two people. I'm not sure if you are the if you are the male, you probably are taking on both of these energies, or you need to. This is very strong, very dominant. Structured, organized, leader, being the leader, taking the lead, being the boss. You could be dealing with the boss or needing to be the boss, needing to take the lead to start fresh. This is a fresh start, starting a new life. Again, take that risk. Remember I said there's fear. Replace that fear with faith. That's what the fool is. Replace that fear with faith. It's time to fly. It's time to take that leap. This is starting at zero, starting from scratch. So some of you are being given an opportunity to start from scratch. And, and it's an equal opportunity with something. You know, it's what you deserve. You're going to be receiving something. 
Let go of your old ideas. Let go of the dead end. This is a dead end. This is a dead end. The past hurts. Change your thoughts. Change your ways. It's time to live again. Yeah, there's confusion. There is some, some, some. There is some, some confusion, isn't there? There's confusion. You may have multiple options. This is multiple options. Choose wisely. Be careful because what you own owns you. Do you? I mean, this is this is. Maybe you've got too much on your plate, and you need to choose which one do you want. You want you want what's most important to you. Is your home most important to you? Is your job most important to you? Is society most important to you? Pleasing them is 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 your own wish fulfillment most of what's most important to you, Capricorn. What's what's number one on your list? What do you want to receive? What can you give? It takes equal give and take. One-sided doesn't work. Oh my God, the Page of Cups. This is an offer of love. This is love. This is... It's a need, you know, a need to be more playful, a need to follow your heart. You could be dealing with somebody that is younger than you that, you know, could make you really happy. This is, this is like a Cupid bringing you an opportunity for love. You got an opportunity for love here to, you know, you, you probably are getting an offer of love from somebody that could help you to release. This is release. This is release. A very stagnant time in your life. But you need to find that courage and that confidence to face your fears and let somebody love you. This is a fresh start. This is starting at scratch, starting at zero. Starting a new journey. The Fool is the first card in the deck. It's when the, the traveler starts the beginning. It's at the very beginning of a brand new journey. Probably with a new love. But you need to choose wisely. You know, you have to give to it. So this is liber This is a end of a painful situation. Ten of Swords. The worst is over. This is a completion of a very troublesome time. I think there's a lot of mental anguish over choosing, making a choice. You know, this is about investment, nurturing, growing. And it's time to pick. It's harvest time. It's time to pick. It's, it's time. It's time to get your reward. It's time to go after what you deserve. Let go of the mental anguish. Let go of the fears and take that leap. Take that leap, Capricorn. You're delaying a new beginning by perhaps letting some sort of illusion or choosing the wrong thing. I don't know what this is. So you may be choosing to hold on to pain when this is releasing pain, though. This is releasing pain, so... Uh, releasing a loss. So somebody, it, this is going over here, somebody is releasing a loss. Let go of that loss. Let go of it. It's easier said than done, isn't it? It is. <clears throat> You're still stable. You still, you still have a lot to offer. You know, maybe you're not aware that how how worthy you are, how value you how valuable you are. You are very valuable. You may not be aware of how valuable you are. Oh my God. So, there could be some, some self-doubt here. You may be doubting your own abilities. Don't doubt yourself. Just because something ended in the past and it didn't work out doesn't mean that this isn't going to work out. Okay, let go of that pain. You have the three of swords. You have that three of swords twice. We have it here and here. So you have been really suffering. You have been really suffering over... You've been really, really suffering uh, mentally. A lot of mental anguish. Maybe there's some mourning. 
you know there's some um, there's definitely some pain here there's some pain you're still holding on to some pain but you're choosing to you're choosing to hold on to pain when there's a new opportunity for love that you know it's time to pick it's time it really is There's doubts hindering you. But this is an opportunity for love. Five of Cups reverse. It's an opportunity to stop crying over the loss. Stop crying over the spilled milk. Stop crying over it and accept the new offer. That's what that is. Reversed. Okay, there's a new offer of love here. There is. There absolutely is. And you may be deciding that, you know, it's time to let go of this pain. This is a <laughs> passionate new beginning. The Ace of Wands. This is a new passionate opportunity okay this could be a new partner this is a new uh, exciting opportunity for growth you're I think there's a uh, you're definitely attracted to it I think there's like this new flame there's this new spark that has been lit and you probably see it but releasing that past hurt is I think we're almost there I think we are almost there um Removing an obstacle. This is removing an obstacle and stepping outside of your comfort zone. So I think that you probably will. You probably will. Remove an obstacle. Step out of your comfort zone and break free. Because you know that it's time. You know that it's time. It's time to go after your what you desire. I think you've got this new vision. you got this new attraction. you got this new love. you got this new... Uh, opportunity to move forward and you may decide to step outside of your comfort zone and face your fears and take that leap because you're probably dealing with an empress that whether you are the female or the male this is an empress this is a beautiful compassionate woman who can take really good care of you <laughs> so um, if you are if you are the Capricorn woman this is you this is you. This is a Taurus or a Libra, typically. But and if you are the Capricorn woman watching this, this is you. Beautiful, compassionate, nurturing. She's all. She's the goddess of love. This is the goddess of love right here. So this is what you are being seen as. If you are the female, you are very attractive. You are glowing at this time. This is the Empress. This, she knows her worth and somebody is probably passionately wanting to invest in this woman. She will give. She will. She will give. This woman will give. She'll give her all. She'll give her all. She's the Earth Mother. She's the Earth Mother. So she will mo mother the whole situation. So anyway, we have a passionate new beginning here. To This is the birth of a new life as well. So she gives birth to a new life after experiencing a lot of pain. So we have the pain that you have been through wasn't in vain. Because now you have an opportunity to get what you deserve. Some of you could be getting pregnant, just saying. I mean, this is very, this is sex, passionate sex that could lead to pregnancy. I don't have to worry about that, thank God, but somebody does. Um, I think that we have somebody here that is releasing a loss, stepping over the edge, removing an obstacle of fear, and following their heart. It's something to celebrate. I think that this is an exciting opportunity for a beautiful new life. Ooh. There's been a delay, though. There's fear. Fear has delayed it. Fear and pain has delayed it. Could happen within one day. Okay, could There could be this sudden desire to just go and boom. You're in love. You are in love. <laughs> Q. 
King of Swords reversed. Unfair treatment. Somebody may have been treating another person unfairly. Maybe somebody hasn't been thinking clearly. You know? Those are thoughts. Let, let, you, maybe, maybe you've been thinking negatively. Somebody could be dealing with a person that has abused them in the past and now they need to take their power back from that past abuse. I don't know. This is abusive. This is an abusive person. This could be a father. This is a man. I don't know who this person is, but there's there's this is abusive. So there's some, and I'm going over here. I think that there's some sort of abuse that has hindered success. Somebody may not have been listening to. They may not have been listening to their intuition. We may have somebody here who's really selfish, too. This is a very selfish individual who only thinks about themselves. <laughs> Doesn't communicate very well. Um, Ten of Cups reversed. It could be somebody you live with. This could be somebody that you live with because this is a family situation, perhaps. This is turning away from a family feud, letting go of a family situation or, you know, the end of a, a change in the family, perhaps. Um, this, is, this is in releasing, releasing an unhappy relationship where there was abuse. So you have the opportunity to release this abusive relationship that has already ended for real and start over with that fool and the empress and the ace of wands. This is a fresh start, starting at zero, taking that leap, starting a new journey and starting a new life. This is a passionate new beginning In love, okay? This is the goddess of love. So this is love. I mean, I can't. That, that's what it is. So this could be a new, new, new partnership. Very exciting. A lot of attraction. It's like it's, it's too, it's off the charts. It is off the charts. This person will wipe your tears right away. Absolutely. So anyway, good luck. Good luck. We have a new beginning here that could grow into a beautiful new life with nurturing, reciprocation, and love. Good luck.